You are listening to the Meaningful Work, Meaningful Life podcast, the show that empower you to redefine the life you want and live your best life now. I'm Francine Belay, your host, and I'm super thrilled to bring you stories inspiration, strategies to get more meaning in your work and in your life, make more money and lead a movement to change the world. I'm a digital communication and brand strategist, business advisor, award-winning author and a speaker. I am on a mission to help professional corporate executives and entrepreneurs to become leading voices in their field by finding what makes them unique and creating compelling messages to the right audience. Welcome back to another episode of the season two of Meaningful Work, Meaningful Life podcast, where I'm focusing on all things money and the income that will match the lifestyle you desire to live a meaningful life. So the season three of this show is coming very, very soon. I have a great lineup of inspiration stories and how my guests are creating powerful movement. Stay tuned. You don't want to miss this. If you liked the season two or the season one, you will love the season three. You've probably heard that a lot of lottery winners go broke only after a few years after they won millions. So this used to puzzle me as I thought surely they might have put a bit of money aside they can live on for the rest of their lives. But the reasons why they lose it all have less to do with money than the psychology and the sudden influx of money that they were little prepared to handle both on an emotional level and on a practical level. So if it were you, I'd like you to imagine this. How will you handle this sudden influx and ensure you stay level-headed, think clearly and stick to your values? As you are thinking about the money that you need to accomplish your goals, I'd like to invite you to do a reality check really now. You need to take a holistic view and consider all the elements in your life that will be affected once you start bringing in more income. I've talked about the opportunity cost in the bonus episode of the season one, and I've shared with you three tools and planners to find clarity in what you want to achieve and how to determine your financial goal. And in the episode 16, I've explained the three key reasons why you are not getting paid what you want. In the episode 17, I have shared the uh, 15 strategies to increase your income to live the life you want. And in the episode 18, I've revealed the five money mindset issues that rob you from the life you want and the solutions to birth those issues. The episode 19 was all about the relationship and how you can systematically build your success network and treat it as your insurance for the future. So in today's episode, I like to do something a bit different and walk you through a visualization exercise to imagine how your life will look like when you have achieved the financial goals that you've set to yourself and the impact on the other areas of your life. Why is it important to do this visualization exercise? Thinking about your goal before it happens, give you the time to reevaluate your priorities and adjust so that when you get there, you know exactly how to behave to make the best possible decisions. Visualization techniques are actually used widely uh, by successful people like elite athletes, business gurus, and other high-performing individuals to attract the desired outcome. So 
It's like a mental rehearsal. You too can use this powerful technique to achieve what you want. This visualization exercise is extracted from the playbook that comes with my book, Personal Branding in the Digital Age. When you buy the book, you also access additional bonuses to help you implement the ideas that are present. Now, I'd like you to start this exercise. Take a notebook or a blank sheet of paper, grab a pen, find a quiet place to sit comfortably and take a deep breath before we start. So write down any insight that comes to your mind as you listen to what I'm going to ask you to do. If you are in a place where you cannot sit and write, make sure you come back to do this exercise fully later. Imagine you have won 100 million, 100 million dollars, 100 million pounds, 100 million euro, whatever your currency is. Take a moment and imagine what business career you will pursue when money is no longer a motivation and you are simply doing what you love. Where are you living? Which country? In which house are you? Is it a city? Is it in the countryside? Or on the beach? How does it look like? Describe this in the most detail. Now, what time do you wake up? What is your morning routine? Do you do some exercise? Do you meditate? Do you go for a walk? Or a run? Or swim? Or simply relax? How do you take care of you in the morning? What do you have for breakfast? Who is there with you? How do you get to the office? Are you working from home? Or do you go to a separate office? How does this office look like? What is in it? Which project are you working on? Describe them in detail. How many clients do you work with? How big are they in terms of size? What do each of them sound like, look like? And talk about most of the time. How do you interact with them? What do you do then after work? Are you practicing a hobby, hosting or attending a charity event, going to a concert or a dinner out or staying in? Write down, write all those details. Which impact you have made today? Which lives have you changed? through your action or your work. Take yourself on a journey throughout the day from the moment you open your eyes until your head hits the pillow at night. And write down all those details that you are seeing. If you need, you can pause and write and continue. Passionately write down what you see. Congratulations if you've done this exercise. You are one step closer to bringing your dream into reality. You can draw or speak out loud on audio or make a video of your notes to summarize the highlight you have generated throughout this exercise and then review this daily and fine tuning. 
So the PDF of this exercise is also available to download in the show note of the episode. So you can go later and grab the text if you want to. Now that you've done this exercise, which action step can you take to start living the life that you've visualized today, right now? What is the smallest thing you can start doing right now to live this life? Write that down as well. What can you do in the next seven days, in the next week? And then what can you do within 30 days? That means in the next month. In three months, what can you do? And what can you do in six months and in a year? Write down all these action steps that you're going to take from today up to a year to live this life that you've just visualized. Then what you like, I like you to do is to share your action plan with a trusted friend or anyone else to hold you accountable to this action plan. So if you would like to achieve these goals faster, there are two ways to do that. One, you'll buy the book, Personal Branding in the Digital Age, How to Become a Known Expert, Thrive, and Make a Difference in a Connected World, which is available on Amazon, iTunes, Audible, as ebook, audiobook, or paper book. The second way is to work one-on-one with me to clarify your objectives and achieve them faster. For that, you need to book a call at francinebelly.com slash call, that F-R-A-N-C-I-N-E, B-E-L-E-Y-I dot com slash call. The show notes of this episode of Meaningful Work, Meaningful Life are available on my webpage, francinebelly.com slash podcast, with all the references and resources shared on the show. And whilst you're there, leave a message in the comment section to let me know about your key takeaway from this episode. And if you enjoyed this podcast and want to show your love and support, subscribe to the Meaningful Work, Meaningful Life podcast on iTunes, which is now Apple Podcast, Spotify, Stitcher, or the app where you are listening to this podcast and leave me a five-star review. It will take you a minute, but it will mean a lot to me and help me spread this message to many, many other people. So thank you for listening to the Meaningful Work, Meaningful Life podcast, the show that empower you to redefine the life you want and live your best life now. I will see you next week for a bonus episode. Until then, dream, act, and make an impact. Lots of love.